Hello, my name is MJ Pangman, co-author of Dancing with Water, a guide to naturally treating, structuring, energizing, and revitalizing your water. A number of years ago, as I began to write about the liquid, crystalline state of water, I was introduced to the work of Dr. Mushik John, a Korean scientist who devoted over 40 years to the study of the molecular structure of water. One of Dr. John's many gifts was an understanding of the biological significance of the liquid crystalline state of water. Another of his gifts was an understanding of how to naturally create the liquid crystalline state. Today, cutting-edge quantum biologists are telling us that this body is a living liquid crystal. Some of the characteristics of crystals and the reason that they're used in solid-state technologies are their ability to store, to amplify, and to transmit signals. Liquid crystals have the same capability, to an even greater degree because they're flexible and they're more responsive. These biologists are also telling us that life itself can be defined in terms of an organism's ability to maintain the liquid crystalline state. As an example, a baby's body has a greater degree of liquid crystalline water than an adult's body does. Another example can be found in what happens when food is cooked. Cooking and processing changes the molecular organization of the food, disturbing the liquid crystalline state and destroying its life force. In nature, the liquid crystalline state is maintained as tiny electromagnetic forces interact with the liquid crystalline matrix. In the human body, which is an electromagnetic organism, crystalline order is maintained as these fields continually pulse through the body. Outside of a living organism, it's more difficult to maintain the ordered state. However, Dr. John showed us that as water passes through a magnetic field, the molecules become organized. And there's a second force in nature that also has a tremendous ability to influence the crystalline state of water. That is a vortex. Another great scientist, Victor Schauberger, demonstrated the power of the vortex. A vortex is nature's way of gathering energy. From a spiraling galaxy to the spiral of your DNA, vortexes organize matter and energy. In essence, they are the creative force of the universe. When vortexes combine with magnetic fields, water is able to maintain its structure for longer periods of time even when it is outside a living organism. So what does all this have to do with the Green Star juicer? The Green Star uses two interlocking and spiraling gears that guide the food as it's crushed during the juicing process. And inside each gear are magnets so that the food passes through a double vortex within a magnetic field. This combination of forces supports and stabilizes the liquid crystalline qualities of the food. What you have in the Green Star Juicer is an amazing piece of equipment that preserves the life force of the food. And it allows the juice to hold more energy and even more minerals. Since minerals are held within the structure of the water, they're held within the structure of the water in the juice and they don't drop out or get left behind in the fiber. The Green Star technology stabilizes the liquid crystallinity in the juice. No wonder people say the juice from a Green Star juicer tastes better. I think it does. And no wonder connoisseurs can tell the difference. The Green Star juicer helps food to maintain its life force and thus to support our own life force.